I have found that this product is a bit hit and miss. But we'll see. This is mint chocolate chip. I like mint chocolate chip a lot. I know a lot of people do not. I actually had to ask our vendor, the Bluebell vendor, specifically to get mint chocolate chip. I like my coworkers, but I do not because it's just they really are kind of annoying. They're doing a lot of stupid things, and the the bad thing about a corporate job is that when one person screws up, then it affects everyone. Like, for example, last Saturday, someone, I don't know if anyone knows what a short change artist is, but it's someone who will come in and will essentially confuse the cashier. Um with money and they'll walk out with 100 extra dollars and a couple people have tried to do this to me and but I don't allow them to because I'm naturally very suspicious of people and I'm not a complete idiot so like I when someone hands me a hundred dollar bill and they're buying a Snickers bar, um, automatically a red flag goes off in my mind. Most of the time, we will do that shit. I say no, because either I don't have the money in my drawer, or I just don't want to deal with it. I think that's really rude to do that. But also... The reason why people do that is they want to get money out of you. And um, so, like, they'll... It's hard, a little hard to explain, but they'll buy something small with a $100 bill or a $50 bill, and they'll ask for it back, and they'll keep, like, asking back and forth back for it until they confuse the cashier and get more money out of them. And one of my coworkers, who's really nice, I like her. I don't think she's dumb, but I think she's kind of naive about people. She tries to help people out too much. Um, I'm very no nonsense. I do my job, but I'm not going to go out of my way for a customer. And I think she does do that, and which then. Now she has to pay a hundred dollars for that. Because she was being bl uh, nice to a blind guy. Just like this old black guy came in who was wearing sunglasses and claimed to be blind. And he wasn't he was just a, he was a, but he ended up getting a hundred dollars out of her. And, but she was wearing headphones and a whole bunch of other our other co-workers have been listening to music on the job and so now we're not even allowed to use our cell phones anymore and 
it sucks. For the people who actually are doing their job. Because it's not really... I think working in a gas station, people have a lot of false impressions of it. It's really, you know, harder than even being like a bank teller because you're doing all the things that you need to know for a bank plus a lot more. You have to be aware of a lot more. And but it's not really a hard job. But you can't be stupid either. So now because of them, I'm, you know, our manager, who I don't really blame him for being a lot more strict now with certain things, but because I work with idiots, now I have to suffer because of that. And like, um, I wasn't feeling well, well Monday, and I really wanted to go home. I had, I had only had like seven hours between shifts, and which are not technically legally allowed to do. Um. The person that came in to relieve me, she's always late. She's always late. And she was like over an hour late this time. One time she, a couple of times she's been over like two hours late in relieving me. And I feel like, and she always has some excuse and it always has to do with her kids. And I'm like, listen. I didn't tell her this. I'm like, I'm nice to her because I want to be like nice to my coworkers. I don't want to have to deal with any unnecessary conflict with them because I have to work with them. But at the same time, I, I know people who have children and they are organized with their life and they can not constantly, almost every day, come in late to work. So, I just kind of feel like that people who have children, some of them, feel like that it's okay to place their burden onto other people who are child-free. And they feel like that's okay. And I don't. Like, almost, like, all, the only person... I work with that does not have a child is a lesbian. Everyone else has a kid. At least one kid. I didn't mean to talk about it for that long, but it's just annoying. <laughs>